Hi everyone, it's Mitch. It's Sunday, uh, 1228. We're back and uh, it feels great to be back. I'm kind of busy today. I don't mean for the short responses on the emails and in the comments and the forum and all that stuff. And, you know, hopefully I'll to, to, to drop in and maybe we'll do a chat and stuff. But I'm just trying to get back up to speed here with everything. Um, we restored back to where we left off and that was Christmas Eve. Everyone knows my other picks. I'm going to try and link to them, or at least, you know, we'll say who, who they were, because we know that I'm hot right now. And, uh, you know, I had Miami over to over Cal. Well, it was a homer pick. It covered, and that's all that really matters. Um, they were getting 10. They lost by 7. I think they could have won that game. When we saw the replays of the Cal players, and they were talking about these holes that they were opening up, they had the Canes players grabbed from inside of their jersey, dragging them down. I saw at least three horse collars that uh, Cal players did that were not called. Um, not going to blame the game on the refs. I still think Miami should have won the game anyway. Um, certainly had their chances. Nate Longshore, you're nothing. Um, nine in the box, and uh, <laughs> you still couldn't get it done. You're on the one-yard line. So, uh, you know... The Canes, a lot to be excited about. I know when I do my 10 top 10s, I always mention Sean Spence as one of the players that I think can play right away in the NFL. I always have a lot of doubters, a lot of people saying that that's a homer pick. Well, you know what? I don't think anyone's calling it a homer pick anymore because Sean Spence certainly looked like the man as a true freshman in there last night. So did all the Miami freshmen. It was just a great job by all of them. And, uh, they're only going to get better and better. If that's uh, our first game of next season, the way a lot of people consider the Bulls, then we'll take it. So uh, let's move on to tonight's game. And uh, I don't think we needed the site back up or uh, for me to do a video to know who, for you guys to know who I'm on in this one because it's Northern Illinois and they're playing against Louisiana Tech. Love Northern Illinois in this one. The reason why I like them, I'm going to keep it real short and sweet. They play defense, Louisiana Tech doesn't. Both these teams' offenses, eerily similar. They run the ball. Northern Illinois is actually a little better, or a lot better, throwing the ball than Louisiana Tech is. Um, Louisiana Tech will have no luck even trying to throw the ball or mix it up against Northern Illinois because they have one of the top pass defenses in the entire country. Um, the way that they were beat, though, by, you know, when they played the upper echelon teams, and that's why, the, you know, they started to tail off at the end of the season, is, uh, you know, teams beat them through the air with with some great throws and great catches. I don't look for Louisiana Tech to be able to do that. Louisiana Tech's going to try and run the ball on Northern Illinois. Not a very good idea. Northern Illinois is going to try and run on Louisiana Tech. Not a very good idea either. Look for a low-scoring, hard-hitting battle. Look for uh, Northern Illinois to come out on top. They're getting a point. It's just gravy. So uh, we're on Northern Illinois tonight. We're glad to be back. See you guys in the chat room. I'll see you guys in the forum. Um, my email responses, my forum responses, um, you know, the chat, I might even be spotty in and out because I'm just trying to get things back up to normal here. And, uh, you know, like I said, by tomorrow, we won't even know that any of this stuff ever happened. Jordan's picks up. He's, uh, he's picking against me again, but... Uh, I'm red hot here for bowl season. Um, Jordan's gonna gonna probably be picking up the pace shortly. I know he's submitted all of his picks. Like I always say, I never look at his picks before I uh, write up my own. So in any event, this is Mitch. Thanks for joining me. Welcome back, and uh, great great to be with everyone again. Um, have a great day. We'll see you in the chat room. We'll see you in the forum. For those of you that aren't signed up for the newsletter, and I sent you guys out a copy anyway when you email requested me, by all means, sign up. Those were winners. That We had Florida State in there. That was, that was, that was beauty, exactly how I called it. Um, defensive touchdown, setting the tone for the entire game. Have a great day. Let's, let's get them again tonight.